Hello, everyone. Wish I didn't have to talk about this today. But I had no choice. Alright. Let's get started. So, I previously touched on a situation that I got in contact with an imposter project, Melody. It's because of this imposter that I uh, almost fell head over the heels obsessively with the real Melody. And because of this whole situation, I uh, do not like engaging Melody much. I can understand her problems and her uh, issues as a VTuber. As I'm a VTuber myself, and I'm currently going through my own issues. At the time of this video uploading, I will put a tag on my description of 18 years or plus. So, I've already done it on Twitter slash X, and I'm planning to do it on YouTube. Let's get back to the situation at hand. I, in my early days of researching VTubing, that I did about over four months four to five months to be more exact before I started doing VTubing through videos. Oh, and by the way, I do stream on Twitch.tv now every day. So, uh, join me there. Finally, yeah, that's it for little announcements. I met a fake Project Melody. Uh, this Melody was a bit of a, uh, a well-known person that blackmails people online that try to become a VTuber or VTubers. Myself, I was searching into it. How this individual found out I was uh, researching it, I have no clue. To become a VTuber. Maybe it was because I was doing PNG tubing a while back. In a one-dimensional setting. But despite this, she caught wind. This individual tried to uh, gather as much information on my VTuber's uh, identity and design and even that of uh, overall plan of origin and future content I wanted to create. It's because of this individual that uh, I ended up choosing to... Oh, block Melody from my streams, as I don't want to relapse into that situation of a, a bit of a over obsessive heartthrob, is how I should put it. And uh, because of that, I have decided to recently unblock her on uh, Twitter slash X. Or, yeah, that's what it's called. Uh, I would get, like, one's called Twitch, one's called Twitter. You know, this and that. But, uh, despite all this, this individual wanted to sell my ideas for their own benefit. This was not okay in my book. When I found out, I eventually uh, took care of the issue. And I have not seen this person since. This whole situation is over. With this person, it's been over for about six to seven months. All I can say at the end of this small little video, please be weary and be careful. There's a lot of fake VTubers out there, or people that try to come off like the original content creator. Rather, they do it through Steam like this Melody did, or, uh, you know, phony Melody as we should call them, or Discord, or even things like Facebook or Twitter slash X. They're always a problem, and it doesn't just relate to Melody. It relates to all VTubers. These individuals cause a lot of pain and strive and problems in the community of our form of content creation. And they don't know how to stop, and they rather get a massive payday instead of a uh, do it themselves so with this a little bit of a video over thank you so much for joining me here today 
I've been trying to uh, come to terms about how to deal with any future collabs with female VTubers or males in that regard. Uh, right now, I'm not looked at much by them. I know they look while not looking. I know they watch while not watching. I know they choose not to engage until something drastic changes. And uh, that's how the VTubing scene works. I'm not a complete clueless on the rules of VTubing or how they get business done. They do it their way. And they do it to protect themselves. Before this video comes to a close, I must address something about VTubing. The reason why we have these avatars is not only to our benefit and the mystery of the allure, but it's a way to protect ourselves from individuals that want to cause us physical harm. Physical, mental, or even spiritual harm. This is why we do this. Thank you for joining me here on this Lionheart Talk. Until next time. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, VTuber and VTuberettes, I am Audi. Later. Ah, can't wait for summertime. And my uh, vacation. Going to Casa del Sol. <laughs> It'd be nice. But at the same time, <laughs> well, the VTuber's work is never done. Eh. Does it even matter? Actually, it kind of does. Hmm. Oh well. Now I hope they can look forward to the full presentation on a later date. <laughs> Join me for summer, folks. <laughs>